Hi guys, so today's video is going to be the Scottish tag and I was tagged by Beauty Creep here on YouTube to do this tag and I was tagged quite a while ago and I'm only now getting around to doing it. Oh boy. But anyway, Beauty Creep tagged me and she made this tag video for all of us Scottish people here on YouTube to do because there's not that many of us. There's a lot of like English YouTubers and you know, and there's not that many Scottish people so this one's for us. Oh, and before I get into it, you may notice that I'm in a different location in my bedroom. Um, I was getting bored of where I normally film and I thought I would just switch things up and move. So I've moved to this area of my room in this wee corner. And because this is a tag video and it's going to be a chatty one, I thought this was quite fitting for this video. <laughs> I'm talking a load of rubbish. Oh. Let's just get started, shall we? So there's 10 questions in this tag and the first one is whereabouts in Scotland are you from? And I am from Perth and that is near Dundee and Stirling and it's quite a big place. I don't live there now but some of my family do and I really like going up to visit them because um, I like visiting them and because they still live there and it's just a really beautiful place. But I don't live there now, I live in a place in um, Lanarkshire and I'm not gonna specify where it is. Some of you that know me personally know where I live, but I don't wanna broadcast where I live on the, the internet. The second question is, where's your favorite place you've been to in Scotland? Hands down, St Andrews. I love St Andrews, I'm obsessed with it. I really want to go again, I just, absolutely love going. I really like the student vibe when you go and you're walking up and down the high street and there's loads of students about. I really like the student vibe. That's probably really weird but I just really like it. Um, I like the seaside and I just I went there when I was younger and it brings back so many memories and I just like walking about and oh I just I'm obsessed with St Andrews. There's also um, a lot of other places that I've been to that I love um, but St Andrews bleh. St Andrews is right up at the top. It's my favourite place ever in Scotland. Question number three is where would you like to visit in Scotland? And people may be shocked when I say this, uh, but I really want to go to Edinburgh. And I've been in Edinburgh, but I've not been in the like main bit, like the city centre bit, the Edinburgh Castle and all that. I've like just drove through it and I've never really been to the main bit. So I really want to go there. Um, because it just looks really pretty and everyone goes and I haven't. I always go to Glasgow, like Glasgow is where I go, like between Edinburgh and Glasgow, uh, I always go to Glasgow, so yeah. I also really want to go to the place that I have completely forgotten its name, um, where the Harry Potter train is and I want to ride the Harry Potter train. That is one thing I want to do, I really want to do that um, and I can't for the life of me remember the name. And that's bugging me, but I want to. Question go there. number four is: What is your favourite Scottish film? Now, I'm a Disney like lover. I love Disney, so I'm gonna have to say Brave because I I love it, and it's based in Scotland, and it's just an amazing Disney film. And that girl with the long ginger hair, she rocks that hair, and yeah, I just love Brave, and it's a Scottish film, so. Um, I have to Question number it. five is do you match up to any Scottish stereotypes? Now that is really hard to say and I don't know why. Um, I don't really know any so I'm just gonna Google some and get back to you. Ah, oh, there's a list. One says alcohol, now I don't really fall into that because um, I'm only 17 and I'm not legally allowed to drink and I don't drink. I'm kidding, I do, but <laughs> that much I swear. And there's one that says ginger hair, now I don't have ginger hair. Um, not that there's anything wrong with ginger hair, I think ginger hair is lovely. If you have ginger hair, rock it. Um, but I just, yeah, I don't fall into that. I'm getting these off Yahoo Answers and some person said they all have lily white skin and freckles. Now, I am pale but I don't have freckles so I kind of fall into that. Okay, someone else said they all eat haggis. Now, I've tried haggis but I don't eat it for dinner like once a week. I've just tried it so I don't fall into that one either. Okay, I think that's enough of the stereotypes and I think it's safe to say that I don't fall into Scottish stereotypes like at all but I am Scottish but I just don't fall into the stereotypes that we seem to have. Number six is what is your favourite Scottish food? Now I don't know if it's 
specifically Scottish, I'm not too sure, but fruit pudding, also known as white pudding, but I call it fruit pudding, it's like something you have in like a, like a, what is this a word? Like a breakfast, like a, oh my god. It's something you have in a cooked breakfast, that's the word that I was looking for, cooked breakfast. Um, and you get black pudding and you get white pudding, although I don't call it white pudding, I call it fruit pudding. And I just don't know how to describe it, it has raisins in it and it's just so good. I love it so much and I hardly ever have it. And when I do, it's amazing. It's so nice. It's really greasy and probably got a lot of fat in it, but it's yummy so. I do not care. Also, another Scottish food that I love is mince and tatties. Gotta love me some mince and tatties. Um, my gran makes some really, really good mince and tatties. She makes it so well. Um, and she just, she puts, chops up carrots as well and has chunky carrots in it. Oh, I wish I, I really want that just now actually. Why does she have to live ages away? The next away? question is, do you follow any Scottish traditions now? I can't say I do. We have Burns Day, the Robert Burns Day, um, in January I think it is, and it's really bad that I don't even know when that is. Um, but people have Scottish dinners, I think, oh, uh, and like have haggis, and um, in primary school you do the poems, and I used to do that, um, but I don't do anything for that now. And I can't think of any other Scottish traditions, so because of that, I don't think I follow any, and that is so bad. But Oops. the next question is what is your favourite Scottish word? Now this is probably the most common one apart from I, but I really like we. I say it a lot, we, we, we. I just like it. It's also French for yes, but anyway. I like we. Not actual we, by the way. I like the word we. Just clearing that up. I also really like the word, well words, because it's true, um, skinny malinky. Or is it one word? I don't know. Basically someone that's really skinny and tall. In other words, I think English people just say lanky, but we say skinny malinky. Is it? Yeah, skinny malinky. I just like that word, skinny malinky. Hmm, sounds weird when you say it and funny. The next question is what is your favourite Scottish song? Now, I don't know if this is a song talking about Scotland and Scottish people because I don't think I know of any, um, but if it's meaning like artists, <clears throat> And then um, Amy McDonald and Katie Tunstall, I think I'm saying that right, are amazing Scottish artists and their albums are fab. So give them a check out if you haven't already because I really Question like number them. 10 is can you recommend any Scottish YouTubers? And of course I can. There's not many, but I know a few that I really, really enjoy watching. Um, of course, Beauty Creep who created this tag and she also did it with Zoe from BZ Vlogs and I'm I swear, I swear that's the name of their channel. If not, like I'll leave everyone's channel below and if I have any of them wrong, I apologize, I'm sorry. I'm really bad with names, but I swear it's BZ Vlogs. Anyway, they are from Glasgow and they vlog and it's really nice to see Glasgow um, instead of like London, for example, because a lot of vloggers are based in London, so that's just um, what I see a lot. And it's nice to see Glasgow for a change and because I'm always there, so it's nice to see Glasgow for a change. Anyway, so, there's also Emma, um, Louisa, there's also Scott Steph Nails, and I think I've just said that wrong, that's like a tongue twister. <laughs> Sorry Steph, but I will leave her channel below as well. I can't think of any more. I know I've forgotten someone and I hate forgetting someone, but if there's any more, I will leave them in the down bar and yeah, definitely check them out because they are all amazing YouTubers and they're Scottish. So, so yeah. that's this video done. I hope you enjoyed this tag video. Thank you Beauty Creep for tagging me. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing day or night or whatever time it is. I hope you have an amazing rest of the day and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.